She thinks my tractor's sexy. It really turns her on. She's always staring at me when I'm chugging along. Fun in the water day. Back and forth, back and forth. Oh, 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 yeah. All we have to do is wait another five minutes and Scooby will go poop. He'll be, he'll drink in so much water that he'll have to take a poop. I guarantee it. Come on! Was I right or was I right? Are you filming me? Good afternoon and How's soon it going? to be a good evening in a couple hours. So, it's a beautiful day. No sauce. Okay. So for those of you that'll notice, <laughs> it's my thing. It's not your thing. Yes, it is. No. For those of you. There we go. That may see a few things going on at our house, few things purchased, so forth. We have. Uh, we didn't win the lottery, unfortunately. Yeah, that would have been cool. Hmm. That could still happen. And then, you know, we'll just pay the house off we have refinanced our house and so we took out a little bit extra cash because there's a few things we need to do to the house like paint it uh, and then yes yeah, see this awful blue plus there's a lot of places where it's chipping and you know the water is soaking through and soaking the walls which isn't good yeah our upstairs extra bedroom there's water damage coming through and our, our we don't have a void in between our walls it's a solid like pressed pieces of cedar so what you see on the outside is what you see on the inside i need to finish the project of our kitchen cupboards i did the bottom ones now i just got to buy the upper ones and uh yay i'm gonna have kitchen cupboards all like, I, yay. all i do is just go to lowe's and buy those prefabbed unfinished ones and it's really cheap and I have a friend that'll help me put it in and you know what would cost us about four thousand dollars to have someone install them I can buy all the shelves or all the cupboards for about 800 bucks this is all the upper cabinet space that I have this one and this one no cupboards other than that so I have nothing, 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 nothing. And then I have the refrigerator. So we want to put a pantry right here. Because right now our extra bedroom is our pantry. This crazy, absolute, horrible mess is our pantry. And we have to put things on the ground we have to i mean i have organized it a million times but when mason comes in here it does not ever say organized because he throws things everywhere trying to get a cereal it's absolutely impossible and a couple other things i need to finish and i need a snowblower i'm tired of the shoveling the snow in the winter and we especially on our long driveway up. 
up a hill up top there so it takes me two hours to shovel this thing when it snows fairly decent you know four inches or more which we get a lot of so it's a lot of driveway for me to have to shovel by myself and it usually takes me about two hours which I'm tired of doing so now I'm just gonna snow plow it it's a pain in the butt but I was also thinking you know why don't I get something that can do two in one so I decided to get a lawn tractor where I can mow the lawns because I have not only my lawn but outside of there's more lawn extra lawn that I, I mow and it gets really tall and big and so between mowing that and mowing all of ours about an hour, maybe an hour and 15 minutes of push mowing. Maybe now it'll only take me about a half hour to mow with a tractor. So if you see a few of these things bought around our house, it's not because... We didn't win the lottery, unfortunately. <laughs> hmm. That could still happen and then, you know, we'll just pay the house off. The whole reason we decided to do a refinance is we bought the car a year ago and our payments on the car are $177. $177. And our house payment, which we don't mind sharing with you guys, those two payments we're fine with, is $862. With the refinance, we're gonna pay off the car. And do a few things around the house. With the car payment pu put into the refinance, that's only gonna bring our house payment up to 942. So how much money are we saving now? About a hundred bucks a month. So isn't, doesn't that like kind of totally make sense? You wouldn't want to do that, right? Mm-hmm. Loan Depot. That's who you want to go through. They don't go through a third party bank or banks. They're, they're in-house financed and in-house writer, in writers. Uh, all that kind of stuff so it's you save a lot of money going through them because you don't have to actually go through a bank or third person because they they're everything all in one within their own building want to save money put your your car payment in save on your house payment plus get money out to do things around the house but one of the reasons why is because I'm losing my two side jobs the side job where I do cleaning around the house uh, you know tr yard trimming uh, that lady selling her house and the shampoos that I've been doing uh, we probably won't be getting very many more of those because the outlet store has been outsourced on the vacuums and shampoos so I may not see very many of those so those were between those two you know those were a big help paying for the whole car pretty much each month and some so we're having to do things a little differently so, either way, that's it for today. Um, I know the boys have some plans this afternoon, so we'll see you a little bit later. Bye, bye, bye. So, here's purchase number one 46 inch deck. Craftsman's Pro 8200 and it has mow in reverse it has an hour and amp meter with Bluetooth with electronic uh, blade engagement and it has the smart lawn technology which lets me know when this thing needs to be serviced and it'll let me know when I need to mow my lawn next. Which I'm sure is probably a lot of, uh, you know, you kind of got to judge that for yourself too. And it's got the deck wash system. And biggest of all, three gallon gas tank and the Craftsman's Pro 
the, or the Craftsman Cooler 7000 Elite Series, 24 horsepower. Okay, so I'm picking up Chinese food for dinner today at our local China house. I'm here at Mom's Vlog 80. How you doing? AKA my brother, sister-in-law. And we are here to watch Great Balls of Fire! You need to get some better underwear. <laughs> so, and then there's the kids over there playing their devices, so. So if you guys like this video, please do a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, hit the red button below. And if you're new, let us know in the comments. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.